that's the sun. We gotta go. We got to go. The sun is coming up. Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Ark. And today, well, I'm going to be heading to the surface. And then I'm going to be trying to head back to the island. So, what I'm going to do here is, I'm not going to do a farm, like I said. What I'm going to do is, I'm just going to go to the island. I'm going to get me some resources, right? I'm just going to get me about 50. Even if I... I don't even think I have 50 of every kibble. I might only be able to do 10 of each kibble. But, I don't know. I'm going to try and do at least 20 of each. Depends on the kibble height and all that. But the island would be the best place to go because that is the one where I have the most setup, farm, and stuff. Where it's all in one spot and I can create them all in one spot. Um, I could technically go to uh, Scorched Earth. But I am lacking on some of the higher end kibbles there. So we are going to try and wait for night time. It is not night time. So we're going to wait for nighttime. I'm going to teleport up to an obelisk, and I'm going to just straight up upload myself. All right? So the way we're going to have to do this, though, is we're going to have to have nothing on us except the teleporter. Okay. As long as I have the teleporter, we should be fine to get around. It's just I don't want to lose all my stuff. So we're stripped down here. We're only taking the teleporter with us. And I'm gonna have to wait until night time because I will probably disintegrate if I go up right now. But we do also got this little Drake, he's almost 50%. Um, also, you guys are legit horrible. Uh, for a minute there, it jumped back. Legit, since yet, uh, two days ago when I recorded the previous video, um, it jumped back to keep the eggs, don't crack them. Then it jumped right back to crack them, so I got really lucky. It just looked at it right now. It is legit spit. Split 50-50 again. Shit. Um, yeah, you guys are going to come back and I'm going to have split those eggs already. I'm just saying. So, if you guys change that, I'm sorry. When I recorded this, you guys had already voted more towards crack the egg. Um, with things like this as well, I think I'm going to also put deadlines in there for voting. I think I should have done that this time. Uh, but yeah, that's that's my bad. Alrighty guys, so I waited a little bit here. Let's let's see if I need to do this in a place where I'm not gonna teleport down. Okay. Let's do it right here on the corner. Now what we're gonna do here I thought I could teleport to an obelisk, I guess. I can't do that with the remote. I can't do that with the remote. I gotta do that with the teleporter, right? No. Oh, I guess. I can't teleport to Obelisk on, uh, huh, I could have sworn when I first tried this I could teleport in between the Obelisks. Okay, I guess not. Um, I guess we're gonna head up on the back of the Rock Drake with a Cryopod, and we are going to have to do this ultra fast. So, hopefully this goes okay. Um, I don't know where the nearest surface entrance is at all. we only got a limited amount of time to get, get around. And I'm pretty sure, though, that there is a surface entrance over this way. If I go far, far enough, I should find one. Okay, if I'm correct, it might be up this way. Might be completely wrong. Is there a cave up here? There is! Here it is, here it is. Okay, we're gonna gamma up. Okay. We got some time. What we need to do is uncling. We're gonna get some stamina here. Once I have stamina, I'm gonna recloak. 
then we're gonna go. This dude will tell us if there's any... Well, you know, you know what's around. Right. See it already in his fur. In his fur. We need the high ground. High ground is key. We got. That's the sun right there. That right there is the sun. We are gonna get a picture, picture of that. We're gonna back out. Now what we got to do is we gotta do this quick because it's starting to become daylight. We gotta go. We got to go. The sun is coming up. I'm sorry, but the sun was coming up. I gotta wait again. I'm gonna have to wait out. Daytime. Okay, I am glad I ran. It got bright quick, honestly. It got really bright really quick. Oh, jeez. Look, it's frying up there. Okay, it's night once again. We got to be boogie quick on this. I'm just trying to get the high ground here. Please just let me get the high ground. Now, if we can get high enough, we can just glide right on over, I'm pretty sure. Okay, we should be able to just glide right on in. Landing zone is clear. Hey, come on, I'm just gonna do this. Just breathe, 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 just breathe. Go in there, mark data, upload survivor, accept. Oh, we did it. And here we are, back on the island, waking up in my house. We've not been here in a hot minute, guys. Okay. Um, The thing is, I don't know how I'm going to get... I got, like, no cinema crops to help me... Get, I got these guys to help me get around. My original cinema crops. Uh, Dinosuchus, how do, all right, I think you might have been one I was using to get around, you were, okay, uh, as you can see, a lot of this stuff has been picked, um, uh, yeah, I am going to be taking that bow, no matter what, we are taking that compound bow, uh, Anything else I could use? A long neck rifle and I could use that, but I'm not. So let's get the kibble. Alrighty guys, so in terms of kibble, what I have here is I grabbed all my extraordinary, my exceptional, and my superior. And now we're down to I just grabbed 50 of my regular, 50 of my simple, and 50 of my basic. And I'm gonna tell you guys something right now. Technically, what we would be looking at all these on Scorched Earth is probably about 13 of these three. And I'm going to be like sitting there another four hours trying to get at least two of these guys each. So, yeah. 
Scorched Earth's farm sucked. This one's a lot better, I'm not gonna lie. I, it's mostly just because of the Akatina. I can't lose it. Terracos, though, that I can't really stay around it long enough. Because I actually just had my game crash. As I was getting ready to show you guys the kibbles, my game crashed and scared me. So. Uh, where, oh, where is my teleporter pad? Like, as you guys, look, look, look at this. Now on the roster, if I disable that, I got all the obelisks and tech terminal. We're not going to the tech terminal. We're going to tech base. It's been a hot minute since we've been at tech base. We'll go check it out. Go check on Karkat, or Kakarodontosaurus. Um, he's... Yeah, he's in the water, but technically he is standing. Um, we also do got you, the mobile base. Do you got anything in your fridge? Uh, you got car, car you got car car eggs. Uh, we do also got one of the Rhine Onantha. Just chilling. I know I can't bring you. I'm pretty sure I can't even bring over a helicopter on. Where are the good blueprint I made before I left? Right now. Let me just double check. Did I. Okay, those are empty cryopods. Okay. Did I leave any. No, I've gotten all of it. Um. Anything here I did leave that I could take? Any shit I can steal? I could I could steal this. Honestly. I might. <laughs> um I do want to grab a transmitter is the thing. I, it needs power, so I also need a generator. In which Do I got the stuff to make a generator? Yes I do. Maybe if I put the end genius. Now, I could craft me a generator, or, hear me out on this, I don't. I just go. I keep on going with no tech, and the kibble is the only thing I've done that I can say is really, really, really uh, not favorable towards me. Come on. I guess, in my eyes, getting the kibble from another map is kind of cheating, especially on Aberration, because I've already set goals there where I am trapped on the island, or I'm trapped in there, but that's kind of backfired on me, because the one creature I was relying on, Blossom, is trapped in her cryopod. She cannot come out on Aberration, so... Technically, one of my major things is I can't let that cryopod die, so I might actually have to work on a cryo fridge, or I might just steal a cryo fridge. We are stealing a cryo fridge, all right? We are stealing a cryo fridge, mostly on the fact that Blossom needs to live, so we're just jacking one of the cryo fridges, and now we're gonna go put this all in the terminal and act like nothing happened. All right, the bow, the bow. All right, what's your durability? Okay, the bow. Alright, that's a good bow. Alright, we, we, we are taking that. Um, we're taking that in a different form, though. Helicoprion, I entrust you with your max level 98% chance of giving me a blueprint. Now. Please, 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 please. My luck. That 2%, it should not even apply to me, alright? Like, please, for the love of God, just give me the bow. Okay. You got five seconds. Uh, I know the chainsaw saw sound is a little annoying, but... Success blueprint. Oh, fuck. Uh, I mean, that's a lot, but that's a really good bow. Thank you. Did he, like, give me the stuff for it as well? Oh, yeah, he broke it down. Guy gave me metal polymer and stuff from it. So you do technically get the base ingredients for the item. Um, 
What do I have? I got nothing in my grinder. I got... Do I got enough? I don't. Not unless I'm sitting on top of a bunch of organic polymer, which I am not. Surprisingly. Okay. I think I'm just going to upload now and we're going to head back to the Aberration. So, that is the wrong slot. I will see you guys over here on Aberration. I'm already planning on doing something special now that we got our kibbles, so I'll see you guys there.